Greetings, models. I am the Fallen Shogun, and welcome. Oh yeah, wrong one. Welcome back to Halflands and Necropolis. So we're running low on coal. We are out of iron. There are wolves over there, and everyone needs food apparently. All in all, not the best. That's actually. So what we do need, really, really do need, is maybe some more peddlers' tents here and there, like there. Get peddlers' tents at the entrance to every area, maybe. Who the hell knows? My lord, we have only four months left before we request for eight loads of worst. Worst? Wait, do we accept that? The Little of Land Garden. The Little of Land Garden. Wait, do we have a quest going? Do I accept that? The appeal from there is terrible. The appeal from here is good. Okay, I see how it works. The industry they hate. Okay, perfect. We do need some more storage, we need more food. And my axe. And his axe? We need his axe too, apparently. So how do I... Jobs, economy, tax, squads, research. Research would be nice eventually. Spell research, trade routes. Mm. Let's sell... What do we have loads of? Skin. Let's sell the skin of the dead. Mm. Sell... Some skin, beer, planks, leather. Uh -huh. Now, what else do we have spare? Loads and loads of skin, that's fine. Okay, we're low on furniture, we're low on the food going back up at least. But we're now low on furniture again. Which is a problem, but there you go. So, yeah, we're building up. Every whole village just is stupid, uh, stupidly built right now. It's a bit of a weird one. Okay, they're making meat. They are low on water. Okay. Do we need another well down? Where's the well? Who is the well? There it is. We have two wells down. See if that helps out. We may have too many buildings needing wells. Also, on the food front, we should be able to put a bakery down. Flour, logs, and wood. Yeah. Make flour. You need a mill. That should actually help out some of the grain issues. We have got grain literally everywhere right now. Okay, that should help out with that. Let's actually have another one down while we're at it. There we go. So they will take the grain, make it into flour, the flour will then go into the bakery, the bakery will then go everywhere else. We may need some more logs, but we're low on the food, we're low on the things. The... But we're getting there. We have a small horde of troops, we have defensive forces over there. Perfect. Yeah, I think we're getting there. Excellent. Military upkeep 600. Maybe we're getting lots of money because of this gold over here we're currently destroying. That's fine. But yeah, we might have to start looking at the actual city we've built itself to see what we can do with it because this is a bit. Eh. The farmland itself may need to be moved, that's fine. The pigs are just everywhere, no one cares. Hmm, okay. I still want to take out this wolf den. Really do. But I think we need more defensive if we lose, because my lord of troll has been spotted. 400 health, 10 to 16 damage. Where's that? He's fine, he's far away. So, let's see, axemen require iron axe and a chainmail. Barracks requires iron spear and chainmail, which is 62 per unit per month. They're more expensive. So an eight-man squad would be ne nearly 600 gold per month. Do we have that kind of money coming in yet? I don't think we do. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. My lord, you have only one more to fill. I don't know what worst is. I don't even know where to take the wood either. I think we actually need some more of these guys. So let's go back up to here. Another woodcutter's lodge. There. And 
there. Let me have another forces lodge here. Let me go along like that. There we go. So hopefully that will solve a few more issues. We need a lot more wood coming in. And we also need to destroy all of these destroyed trees. Hopefully I'll put more stuff down. As you can see, the yeah, is looking nice. We're getting stuff. We have people leaving all the time because no one's eating food for some reason. Do you send out the squad to attack the troll? We could do. But there's no guarantee we'll actually win against it, to be fair. No guarantee we'll win against the ghosts either. Or the wolves. Get over it. Let's go appeal. Wait, house level 4, this needs higher appeal. Oh, I see why, yeah, yeah. Okay, I understand why you don't like it. It's, it's disgusting here, isn't it? Yes, it is. He's still disgusted. How dare he still be disgusted? He's still disgusted. Oh, now he needs food. Never mind. So people are always leaving, people are always arriving. It's a bit of a mixed bag here right now. The lack of food is killing us. Why are we so low on food? It's got to be a storage issue. It's got to be a storage issue. Let's put storage down here. Sod it. There we go. That should hopefully help out with a few things. See that? There's people pouring out to grab food now. And resources. My god, there literally is. They are pouring out to the farms? Where are they going? It is the farms issue. Okay. That's making flour. We now have a bakery making bread. Let's actually up the bakery to a second one. So wood might still be an issue, but we are getting lots and lots of food being made. We should hopefully get delivered to the people, but yeah, as we see, it's not always being done. I used to be good at this kind of game. Now it's looking like, how did I used to be this stupid? So we do need more tax offices as well, that's fine. Don't have them too close to the houses and they won't downgrade. Furniture's a bit of an issue. Okay, they're still cutting down trees, that's good. We have foresters redoing the trees. Let's go sell off everything we don't need. Sod it. Let's get all the trade. I don't know if those go away on their own, but sod it. They're making the place look ugly, and I've already done that enough. But it's glorious city of Necropolis. Got plenty of cotton. What are we doing with the cotton? Are we using it for anything yet? Wool or cotton, which is textiles. We're not actually doing anything with that, are we? Okay, they're officially out, so go away. Magic Tower, Defence, let's have one here. Pretty, but you know. So what's that marketplace I keep looking at? Marketplace can be accessible with four merchants coming to the city, left click the building. Set so resources by sales, marketplace will take items from storage yards as well as workshops. You need to enable appropriate trade routes before you can buy or sell resources. Aha! Uh -huh. So we actually need this here. Oh, no, we don't. We don't need it here. It's made everything ugly. Let's have this over here, then. Next to our storage depots. Let's make this a storage area, then. This is insane. There's huge amounts of resources just being delivered. So, I can tell you for a fact I've not built a good city. So they, my god, it's a lot of stone, will be taking skin and selling it. Okay, yeah, they're going out. We actually have everything filled with huge amounts of resources. We actually do need some more bakers. Uh, let's have another one of these over here. There we go. 
I don't want to click on you, Steamford. No one cares about your little life. There we go. Some beer? Are we selling beer now? If I join this up, will it make it look ugly? No, thank God. I'm sorry to interrupt you, Mirage. The plague strikes. Blast! How dare I get plaguey? Right next to the apothecary, too! We actually probably need some more of these. How many do we have? Two? Let's have another one, then. What do they look like? I've forgotten what they look like! Husbandry? An aviary? We could get some eggs, I guess. Those will be needing, obviously, for stuff like, um, archers. We still have an eight-man squad of axemen here, just doing nothing. I really don't think we'll be able to kill the walls off, but we're going to give it a chimmy time try. Because why the hell not? Alright, oh, okay, let's all going out killing trees. Food is still an issue. Where's he going? Why are you going that way? We needed this! Okay, furniture's an issue. Look at this. Okay, we're going to have to check these trade routes. Let's start selling textiles. Can we sell textiles? Yeah, we can. Good. Are we making textiles? Is the question. Not enough workers. That's because everyone's leaving because we don't have any food. We demand you contribute eight loads of stone. I accept. Dispatch. Thank you. Sir. So everyone's leaving. I don't quite know why. It's like we can't grow food if everyone buggers off. Food is still the major problem here. Hmm. It's always food, actually. Like here, there's 70 food! We have so much wheat! We may have made the farms too big. What's this me missing? Flour? <laughs> okay. We're not making enough? Guess we're not. Let's get a couple more down then. Excellent. So we're going to keep on going, getting this farming industry up and running. We have people literally everywhere. Look at them all. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. We're still losing people, but who the hell cares? We have stone down there, who the hell cares? We have people going for wonder down here, but sure why but there you go we'll get rid of these we're out of coal we have some gold research is available Ooh. we can now research mining no we can't oh construction no i'd rather have mining right now mining level one to actually start doing uh, deep mining and if people are coming back until we run out of food then they leave again sods Furniture would, of course, be an issue. How are we doing? How are we doing? How are we doing? What are you doing? Oh. I'm still not certain those trees grow back. I'm really not. The house will evolve in the next month. Oh, excellent. If we get the textiles up and running, we'll be very happy. Just needs cotton, good. So they're making textiles and then we're selling them over here? I don't see anyone do anything over here. I really have. I think we're growing too much cotton. So we can also upgrade it to clothing? Clothier's shop. Requires textiles. Produces cloth. Weaver's shop. Let's have another over here. 
Pillow maker. Textile and feathers. Ooh. Wood burner. Requires logs, produces coal. Herbalists. I think we might be able to get these clothes in the shop, stop making stuff. We just need textiles. It should be pretty simple. Excellent. So we have weird, weird industries everywhere. This does not look like a good place to live. In fact, I might just move over here. Next to the witch's hut and the spider lair. So we could just move the city slightly. That might be the best bet, actually. What does this need? Are you making anything? You just delivered textiles and walked off. I also can't tell if we're winning. I don't think we're winning. Huh, okay. So the pigs are friendly. There's a pig on the bench. Pig on the bench! So the necropolis is growing steadily. Vaguely. Food's always an issue. I don't know why. We have literal food everywhere. Let's check my trade again. I'm not buying it, am I? Are we selling any? Not of 16. No, we're not selling any textiles. Because one was selling other things too. Let's, let's sell 16 grain. No, that's meat. Let's sell 16 grain. Uh... Yes, on it. It's not selling stuff. There we go. That's better. It's not getting money from stolen. Stolen from good stuff. Got gear everywhere. We're actually making clothing, good, we have to upgrade to the next level for some of these houses. Then they'll get complainy about food and downgrade again. That's how I like my places. Complainy. Complainy about the grainy. The grainy complainy. What's this? That's a beer brewery, okay. None of workers. Are we losing people again? We've gained next to 100 people. I also don't think these are growing back. I really don't think they're growing back. I, I can't tell, because like always, I don't know anything. I'm also recording these in advance, because I might be away for the time as they get released. We'll have to see. Let's have another one of these over here. And the forces lodge over here. Then of course we need some more woodcutters. I think we're doing okay. How goes our trading over here? Who are you? Danlinger the citizen! Damn you, Danlinger. Your Majesty. Your Majesty. But yeah, we need definitely some kind of defences. So when we're defending against this wolf lair, that's about... Shit for now. Come on, go for him. Oh, what are you? Carrying four grain. Oh, we're selling stuff. That goblin's going to escape. We had no defences over there. Little sod. Oh well. So the military's going to be pushed back over to here in case the wolves attack, because they're literally the most greatest threat we have just next to us. We're low on food again. Good food. I can see the food. Uh, hmm. I guess let's get a second set of barracks out. Let's even get a second load of um, axe men. We're going to try and attack that place up there. Uh, it's going to cost money, but we need the military. We also need more tax men. We really do. I think. Apothecary. Constabulary. Tax office. Yeah, maybe we do need some more. Although this I quite like. They're still. Yep, they're still walking through it first. Annoying, but there you go. 
What are you doing? You're not peddling the right gear. No one. Oh, they are. They're getting more medication. Alcohol? Need more alcohol. What's this missing? Box wood. Missing logs. Only more woodcutters. Okay. This is just insane, this. So all these woodcutting lodges are all competing, but we should get a lot of logs out of this. But we'll have to see, because again, we don't quite know. Research available. 515, yes! That means I can research... Mining. Which means, if I notice correctly... So we can now mine stone from underground. It does not require a book ground source of stone. There we go. So now I can have unlimited supply of gear. That will help out. Also, again, we need some more storage down here. So let's go one, two. Change all to only stone. Change all to only stone. Okay, the axemen are being grown. We're going to get another squad out, and then we can start attacking the walls in the next episode, I feel. Their doom will await us. I want to see how powerful this is. I have yet to be attacked properly. But they so long. Alcohol. Falcohol. There we go. So this is now be our new thing. Obviously, we're going to have a quarry. Interesting design. The cogs don't mesh, look. The cogs are physically touching each other while they're going in between. Huh. Who designed that did not know how cogs worked. Okay, we have lots and lots of wheat coming in. We have lots of flour being made. We've got bread being done. We're still low on logs for the brewery now. Got trees being planted everywhere now, though, so that's good. So we're getting, we're getting logs, we're getting logs, but yeah. I'm sorry to interrupt you, oh. Your Majesty. Oh my God, theft! You'll never catch me. Mean of a constabulary over there, okay, I understand this now. Let's have a constabulary just here then. Four thousand gold! We have eighteen hundred people though, we're doing pretty damn well. Need some boots. These guys have got clothing then, yes! Now this, this here is an issue. Let's check our trade routes, that's... Hmm. Let's up the grain, because why not? Let's... Hmm, we don't have anything else we can really sell, do we? Which I have a lot of, anyway. Actually, let's up the stone to these guys. The textiles have yet to be sold. Um... Okay, let's leave it at that. I get another one down. Another marketplace. There we go. And my axe. Okay, so it's going to cost 400 gold per trained axeman, and obviously an upkeep of about 40 per month as well, so that's fine. We have the money for the military now, we will hit this place, we'll wipe it out and hope for the best. We will probably die, but we'll find out in the next episode, because I have been the Fallen Shogun. This has been Necropolis in Heartlands. If you enjoyed it, as always, like, comment, share, and subscribe. If you comment, I will reply. If you like the series, we'll carry on for longer, and of course, if you subscribe, you do become part of the Fallen, you get his axe. And at the end of the last battle, I will see you in Valhalla. Three and eight. Mm -hmm. Ciao for now, people. Bye.